let m and n be positive integers if x square plus mx plus 2n is 0 and x square plus 2nx plus m is 0 and they have real roots then the smallest possible value of m plus n is now the first equation is a quadratic equation okay having the coefficient of x square as 1 coefficient of x as m and the constant term is 2n when does a quadratic equation have real roots when b square minus 4ac is greater than or equal to 0. So m square minus 4 into 1 into 2n should be greater than or equal to 0. Or m square should be greater than or equal to 8n. Similarly, the second equation has coefficient of x square as 1, the b term as 2n and the constant term as m. It will have real roots only when b square minus 4ac will be greater than or equal to 0 or we will have 4n square minus 4m greater than or equal to 0 4 4 cancel n square minus m greater than or equal to 0 implies n square should be greater than or equal to m now the left hand side expression connects m square with n and the right hand side expression connects n square with m so i'll first square this equation the left hand side i will get m raised to 4 is greater than or equal to 8 square n square that is m raised to 4 greater than or equal to 64 n square but n square is greater than or equal to m right so in place of n square i can substitute the value of m i will get m raised to 4 is greater than or equal to 64 m now since m and n are positive integers they are definitely not equal to 0 so i can cancel out m on both sides m cube should be greater than or equal to 64 implies taking cube roots on both sides m should be greater than or equal to 4 now n square is greater than or equal to m so basically n square will be greater than or equal to 4 giving you n greater than or equal to 2 they have asked the smallest possible value of m plus n m smaller smallest value will be 4 smallest value of n will be 2 m plus n the smallest value is 4 plus 2 giving you 6.